Hello and welcome back to On Your Beauty. Today's video is going to be an update on my makeup inventory and also so you can see my new storage. I hope you can see that off camera. Anyway, um, got some new drawers and everything else. And while I was just moving everything over to the drawers, I did get rid of a wee bit more makeup and you would have seen in recent empties over the past few months. Stuff I've been testing out and getting rid of if it doesn't work, etc. So I thought I would give you a wee update. It's been four months. So I think the next one I'll do it in maybe sort of four months or six months. I was going to do it every three months, but we'll see how we get on, shall we? I will take you through everything and I'll tell you how much I have of everything. Um, if you have any questions on anything, of course, just let me know down below. So let us just dig in. Of course, the makeup storage isn't as tidy as it could be or should be or anything like that but it's you know organized for now and i'll probably figure out a different way of organizing it sometime in the future of course there's also the disclaimer i have to say it's not bragging showing off anything like that at all i'm actually trying to cut down on my makeup etc so let us just dive right in shall we so we're going to start with um eyebrow powders and things like that so i'll let you actually see that's good this is just my base drawer and let me see eyebrow powders i still only have one for gels i actually have two now so i have my benefit gimme brow and i still have my clear mascara from collection which i should probably check as it's looking pretty gross uh, for eyelid primer i still only have one no that is a lie i have two i have this one and i have this wee sample for face primer i've got five and for lip primers i have none yay no lip primers i only had one before so the only thing that has changed is the eyebrow gel and that has actually gone up because i now have two um and the lip primer because i have none for foundations i did have 11 foundations there were nine liquid and two powder so i now only have four liquids so you've got these four one two three um, oh, and my Dior foundation, which is out because I was doing a wee video, and I still have the two powders, so they're both the Bare Minerals powders. For foundation samples, these are down to four. Where are they? They're under here. So there's one, two, there. Good grief, where did they go? There's another one. Well, you know, you can tell. There are four in there. I have been using them up. And I have two BB cream samples now, so I have this one. Oh, there's the other one. So I have this one from Genvira, I think it is. And I have, oh, this Ren one, which I'm almost out of actually. I must finish using that up. So those are additions. I didn't have those before. For concealers, I had, so that's... Five foundation samples down to four plus two BB cream samples. So kind of sort of evens out almost except I've got an additional sample. The concealers. I have four of these collection or Max Factor concealers. I've still got my 17 one, my MAC. I bought this collection illuminating concealer and oh my NARS concealer which is out for a video and I've still got my powder concealer from Bare Minerals. So I went from having six cream concealers to having eight. So that's actually gone up. I now have nine concealers in total instead of seven, which is just not cricket at all. Um, for under eye setting powder, I still only have one of those. And for face setting powders, I only have four now. I did have five, so that's gone down. So I've got one, two, um, three, oh, Oh, four. There it is. So, four uh, face setting powders. Sorry if I'm sniffing and stuff through this. I've just got a bit of a snuffly nose. Um, for contour, I've still only got the next one. I also use this for contour, but it's actually more of a bronzer, I think. So, I've included that as a bronzer. So, I've got two bronzers. So, there's one there. And my next bronzer is this one here from Bare Minerals and Skinny Dip. It's the lightest bronzer from Bare Minerals. So while we're here we will do the blush. I did have 37 powder blushes. I now have 31. Yay! Win there. Um, for cream blush, so powder blushes are pretty much all over here. And then for cream blush I went from having 
if I can find it, I've just lost where I am. Oh, I went from having 13 down to 12, so I've got rid of one cream blush. Um, and that includes this thing as well, even though it's a liquid. So I am getting better at getting rid of stuff that has gone funny or whatever else. So the, you know, I'm getting, I'm getting there. Um, for highlighter, I have 11 in total. I have five cream now, so one, two, three, four, five. Five cream and one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, am I, hang on, one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah, six powders. So I've got one of one of my cream highlighters. It was that girl from Benefit. You would have seen that in an empties video or part of my project pan. You would have seen it at some point. So we are going to move on to lip products. I'm aware that these things are not the best organized and they're kind of all over the place, but I know what I have and I can find things. This drawer is a bit better organized, isn't it? Um, lip products. Let me just move the camera so you can see. So for lip liner, I had 12. They're just here. And I still have 12, so nothing has changed there. For liquid lip gloss and uh, sort of lip color, I did have 21. I now actually have 22, so that has gone up. There are some things that have gone up and some that have gone down. Lips seems to have gone up. So I now have, um, what did I just say? 15 of these. I had 12 to start with. No, that's a lie, sorry. I had 21 to start with and I now have 22. So that has gone up by one. It did go down to 20 and then it went up by two. So. For lip stains, so um, I've actually lip stains slash more, these are just the chubby stick sort of style of things. So I've classed these together now instead. So maybe that's where it's just got confused. That's what I'm sort of going with. But I have 15 of these now. And I did have 12. I did do a swap with Rebecca lately, so you know, she sent me some of these and that's possibly what's happened. So I now have like Wet n Wild ones, for example, and this lovely Revlon one and um, that's another Wet n Wild one. Oh, there it is, from Jordana as well. So I've got a few new additions on that front. For my pipe polish, I still only just have one pipe polish. For lipsticks, that's also gone up. I had 55, I now have um, 61. So I've now got 21 high end, so that has gone up from 16 to 21. I've now got 21 high end and 40 high street. So I got rid of one from here and I've added quite a few here. I've got the additional um, MAC lipsticks. I have two more Urban Decay lipsticks. Um, one of them is out for a video and the duo one that I bought is out for a video and my NARS lip, um, lip pencil that lives in here is also out so a few bits are out unsurprisingly but yes I've got a few more high end oh and there's a Bare Minerals one as well that's a new addition um, you would have seen some of these before so I have quite a few more MAC ones as well oh there's a MAC one it should be over here oh I'm just wrecking the place but yes, you can see that <laughs> I need to figure out a way of slotting these in. I think that's going to be a DIY project where I get some plastic um, pill holder things and stick those in so I can actually have everything upright in this drawer. It drives me a wee bit insane that it falls down all the time, but that's life. Now, we're going to go on. Oh, I never finished. Sorry. Um, I've actually got lipstick samples. I still have the four that are in this. And I actually have the addition of a Charlotte Tilbury lipstick. So I did use one up and then I got, um, oh, I got a new one to add in. So I have that now as well. Now we're going to go on to eye products. Going to have to move you up even more. So for um, eyeliner, I had 35. I now actually have 30. Four. I actually have 33. That's a lie. I have 33. I got rid of two eyeliners that were off. I got rid of two eyeliners that had gone a wee bit funny and one I'd almost used up and it would just dry up on me. So, um, yeah, I've now got that down to 33. And nothing has changed on the cream liquid front slash gel front because I now actually have a few liquid liners even though I got rid of some liquid liners. So I have two, two brown ones from Jordana and 
if I can find them. So I have two brown ones from Jordan and the Fabio liner and I've got a black one as well um, on that front. We'll do the um, palettes while we're here. I've actually got, I went from having 36 to 37, even though I got two additional ones which are just sitting out there, the um, Beauty UK palettes. I did use up some of the other palettes, but then I got some additional ones. So these are all nice stored like this. The Bare Minerals, they're quads, duos, trios. I just count those all as palettes because, well, they're not singles, so they count as that. I did use up the other one of these. You will remember the infamous brown that refused to die. So this is what this looks like whole. I've not actually opened it yet. I'm going to wait until I need to. Oh, I've got black powder on my finger. Um, Sleek. Um, MUA, Urban Decay, Inglot, Tarte, Sephora, Dior, what else, more Urban Decay, Sephora, uh, Alme, Wet n Wild, more Wet n Wild and some Benefit. So that's in this drawer. We'll go on to the singles. So for the creamy um, creamy eyeshadows, cream eyeshadows I should say, I went from 19 to 6. So I was testing out more of them and those that had gone funny, I just got rid of those. So those are gone now and I got rid of some of the eyeshadow pencils slash sticks. So they went from 13 to 11, which is good. I'm starting to get better at checking the expiry dates on these things. Um, for the single eyeshadows, they haven't changed. It's still 43. I did obviously get rid of some bits and pieces that weren't working for me, but then I did the swap with Rebecca and I have some other bits and pieces since. So for mascara, I've actually gone down slightly, which is good. I went from 11 to 8 full-size mascaras, and I've got three wee samples, which is good, if you can see. Yeah, so I have those full sizes and those samples. And that is it for the makeup side. Now let's check out nail polish. So these are where I store my nail polishes now. If I just pop it open. I've just rotated them so they're all upside down. Don't panic, I don't leave them like this all of the time. I leave them like this for a while and then I flip them the other way up just to help them mix and stuff. This is just the way I like to do it. Everybody is different. So I have still got lots and lots of nail polish. I actually have more instead of less. I went from 123 to 128. Yeah, I have a problem. I'm getting better at sort of going through and using them all a lot more now. My nails are... St I don't actually have any on. <laughs> but now that I'm sort of using... Um, now I have them here, I should say. I'm using them a lot more. And I still obviously have the two nail art pens and the nail art polish. These just haven't been slotted in anywhere. I'm going to just stop myself buying anymore until I can go through and get rid of ones that I don't want. But isn't it just so pretty like this? All of the colours. These are sort of the crazy glittery things over here and some yellows and golds and bases like whites and pinks and brownie colours and what have you. And then I've got like pinks, uh, pinks and reds to purples to blues to greens kind of grouped together sort of I don't know it makes sense to me so that is it for all of the collection do you like the box we did that as a DIY project I say we me and my other half he built it and I painted a bit of it and messed up some of it but isn't it cool if you watch our vlog channel you would have seen us do that which is cool so yes that is it for the inventory and new storage I keep making a mistake throughout that I was saying oh yes but Rebecca lately sent me stuff Rebecca had sent me that stuff before I did the first inventory didn't hadn't she I've just been a complete muppet but you know I was clearly just trying to make excuses for myself but I definitely have I've cut down on some of them like the foundations have gone down my blushes I've trimmed what else I've started to use up some of the samples, but then I get other samples with things I buy. So I did actually use quite a few samples and now they're back again. Some things have gone up, mostly in the lip department. I think it was the biggest, yeah, it was the one that <laughs> increased the most, unfortunately. But I don't mind. I use them all, so I don't really mind. Um, the eyeshadows, they actually went down. Like the cream shadows went down, the eyeshadow pencils went down. The mascaras definitely went down. I'm down from 11 to 8. And I'm about to be down to seven actually, so that's good. I now have samples I have to use up though, so you know, kind of evens out, I guess. 
and eyeliners, I'm getting rid of, better getting rid of those that have gone off. What else have I really cut down on? Not really anything else. But I'm getting better at using things up, so I've used up a few bits and pieces. If you ever see my project pan, you would have seen that I finished some more makeup things. And I always get so excited when I finish makeup stuff. So I am really making an effort. But yes, I might do this in four months. I might wait till six months and then update you then. But I am keeping a tally, so when I use stuff up, I do actually update this and then I wipe it down and then update it again. So this has come in quite handy. I need to get myself more of a, a purse friendly version I think just to have just to stop me buying anything else because I want to put myself on a low buy for a wee while not a no buy because we know that that never works for me ever like I'm awful at it I think if I put myself on a no buy I just feel the need to buy things but if I put myself on a low buy and start carrying this around I think I might maybe succeed a wee bit better so I might try and figure out a way of making this nice and small and condensing it as much as possible but that is it. I think I've waffled on enough. Thank you very, very much for watching. And yeah, please like if you liked. Um, please subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.